Hello internet, welcome back to more Deltarune. In the last episode, we made it here to a second dark world, met our new antagonist, the Queen, found Noel, and found a bunch of blue check marks. This time, we're going to be heading further into the cyber field. I believe we have to go this way. We already bought bagels from them. I only edited the last two episodes yesterday. Um, oh boy. The game, like, dropped frames, which is not something I've ever seen it do before. Uh... Yeah, I think the game is not used to being... existent. Light candy? What is light candy? I don't actually know what this is. We're gonna use a dark burger. Uh, on everyone. I don't want to go save again, but <laughs> yeah, no, I've never seen light candy before. I don't know when we got that. What do you have to say? <laughs> Good luck figuring out which ride to take. This right ride is the right one. I like that, dude. I like their uh, their vibes that they give off. We already took the other two la uh, rides in the last episode. Those were where we got two out of the three blue check marks. This fellow. <laughs> nice of you two to come back into existence. That was nice of you. End. All right, what's the deal, twerp? Who's a twerp? The name's Sweet. Oh, like sweet? Oh, like sweets? Don't tell me I haven't heard of the sweet cap and cakes. Um, doesn't ring a bell. Guess our act's still a bit underground. Sweet cap and cakes. Not only are we Cyberfield's best musical trio, we're also the last resistance against the big bad queen and all her crew. And that starts with resisting you! What? We're fighting Queen too! Nuh uh uh! Cap and saw you help her kidnap some girl. Hey, hey, Cap! We won't let anyone lay a finger on Mademoiselle's. Except us! That's not the point, Cap'em! It's like half the point. 60%? 55? We're rebels, not players! We're rebels that play. We don't play! We don't play! That's it! KK, get over here! KK, are we players? I'm a CD player. Wait! They're getting away! Sweet, chill. There'll be other bad guys. No, this is our chance! Are you ready? Let's fight! Okay. Yeah? Play some battle music! Okay! Sweet Cap and Cakes blocks your way. This is one of the most forgettable bosses in the chapter, and you wouldn't believe that considering this is, like... These are awesome designs. I fucking love this. It's a dance battle. We have to dance and get all of them to dance. Everyone dance with Sweet. They're totally lost in the groove. Hey, I love this song! Are we having fun? Hey, don't touch the hat! So this is actually somewhat challenging. I've said- I think I said this in episode, like, 2 of chapter 2, where the battles here are more difficult than they were in chapter 1. Perhaps if we can get them all to dance, we can win? Indeed. Everyone dance with KK, they're totally lost in the groove. Hey, I love this song! Dance! Dance! Everybody dance! So did they pay the venue fee? Everyone's sneaking into concerts these days, but this concert was kind of forced on me. Sweet snapped out of the dance. Wait, I can't dance with bad guys! Chris, just keep trying to dance! Hey, I love this song! Okay. Isn't this mix Shway? I'm pretty sure that Shway is a reference to Batman Beyond. Or, I think Batman Beyond, which is like a old Batman TV show where Bruce Wayne is like the old mentor, 
and it takes place in like 20 something. I don't know, it's weird, but shui is a word they say in that. I forgot my next dance move! Um, Chris, maybe if you keep dancing? Let's get Cap'n to dance, we haven't seen him dance yet. Everyone dance with Cap'n, they're totally lost in the groove. What, you wanna see my moves? Oh, oops. You need to actually pay attention in order to dodge attacks, believe it or not. Sweet snapped out of the dance. Wait, I can't dance with bad guys. We already said that. Hey, is this really working? Maybe if Chris, um... Maybe if we tried ballroom dancing instead? Hey, why the hell do we need Chris to act? Because that's, um, Chris's unique talent, so... You think I'm too stupid to dance by myself? Susie learned S action. She can act from her magic menu. Susie, I don't think you should... Happy feet, dumbass! Susie made Ralse learn R action even though he didn't want to. I I'm sorry, Chris. Now that we have done that, everybody has an act menu, although they only have one action per battle while Chris can have multiple. So everybody is dancing with everybody. Everyone is dancing. the beat! Watch my moves! Dance! Dance! Hey losers, wrap it up! Battle's over! Over? In other words, we lost? Does that mean we can be friends? KK, no! Fighting's not really my style anyways. Yeah, because you're a coward! I mean, it was fun dancing, but... Sweet, don't worry. I think our dancing beat them. Beat them? Yeah, all mercy-like. See, when we danced with them, it convinced them we're cool. Now they're on our side? Yes. Hey, you there! Welcome to the good side! We are the good side! Just go with it, Susie. Let's rendezvous at our junk shop. We jammed the door shut, but we'll kick it open. Alright, everyone, let's go! Those are by far probably my favorite character designs in Chapter 2. They're just so fucking good. <laughs> Susie has a really cool, like, sliding animation. That's awesome. Is that awesome background again? Wait! No! Ah! Why am I so far from you two? Can't talk to him, but... I didn't realize we were on a we were on a conveyor belt because you can't see that it's moving. Uh, that way is unblocked now. The way to the city is now open. I think I'll stay in the countryside a bit longer though. Been there. Haven't actually. I heard this on assuming stores, the rebel base, but I realized I don't really know how I would help them. Yo, what's up? Hey! Tell me about yourselves. I'm sweet. Ladies call me Cap'n. KK! We used to work the sound in this town. Until Queen came around. KK is short for cakes. She made music against the law. Unless you make a song she likes. But the only junk she enjoys are reverse diss tracks where the vocalists put themselves down or praises Queen. Or noise music. But even if Queenie tries to put a limiter on us, you can't stop the music! Hear that? We'll just go on the ground! Crash! Boom! Bang! That's why we made this junk shop. We'll fund our musical rebellion. Can we make music, noise music too? Performance. Whoa, wanna see what we got? Yo, yo, can you handle this? Hold on to your antennas! Yo, how was that? Did you get rocked? All our songs are only four seconds long. Me too. Queen wasn't always so... harsh. No, she was. She just got worse somehow. It wasn't until that dark fountain showed up that she started going into overdrive. 
Night this, night that, fountain that. Like, what does that knight even have going for it that I don't? Come on! But like I said, she wasn't always so bad. She used to give me sweets for being so sweet. Huh? But I never got candy. You kept calling her a hot mama, Cap. Yeah? Is that wrong? She looks like a mom and tends to overheat. KK, help me out here! KK, what do you think? Huh? M me I like candy. Yeah, you're right, KK. We gotta focus on what's important. If the band fights, we'll get out of tune. Anyone have any lemon drops? Our main gig is making scrap in the machines. Our clients are sometimes a bit off-key, though. They smell off-key, too. Like some little weird guy. He wanted us to sneak into Queen's Mansion. We're just rebels. We don't want to get in trouble. But recently, we got a real high-class client. A man of taste! He had a way with words! I couldn't even understand him! Now all we gotta do is follow the blueprints, right? It'll be our big time break! Yeah! Haha! <laughs> it's gonna break apart! Big time! Nice. What do you have to sell? CD bagels? These are actually $20 more than the cheaper way you could have gotten them before. But this is the only way of getting them for the time being, so... Go for it. You might notice our inventory space is significantly larger now. I don't recommend, like, buying a bunch of items because you don't actually get access to all of them. You only have access to the same amount you had in the last, in the last chapter, but... I'll buy a few more CD bagels. See ya! Smell ya! Hear ya! I feel like I didn't really have a consistent voice for any of them. But, you know... I'm sick, my throat hurts, give me a break. Crash, boom, bang! There's a terrific noise coming from the building nearby. You are filled with the power of noise music. Alright. Not gonna save. Got a bunch of wear wires here, we might- Oh. Smorgasbord too. Alright. Uh, we will act on task with soft voice. We'll... S action Vera Vera Coon, I guess? There, there, it's okay, little kitty. Susie commiserated with the enemy. Stick it to the man, dude. Even if that means cloning yourself or whatever. Bzz, meow, 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 meow. Just what the doctor ordered. So true. Honestly, this is a nightmare. Smorgasbord was right. Uh, so we got to spare with Chris and Susie. And then we'll use Pacify on Werewire. There we go. That was difficult. Also, I want to talk to the hat guy. That's actually important for a joke in this room. Hopefully he doesn't, you know, get hurt at all, ever. Tension bit. I wanted to talk to the file too. Oh, well he's gone. Bam. Hope nothing bad happened to him. I believe that the guy with the hat says something along the lines of not wanting to become a werewire, and then when you go back around to see him again, he's gone, and that's where he goes. <laughs> Shall I help you say? No, I shan't. I haven't the faintest idea what that is. Not me neither, for what it's worth. I don't really save a lot. While I'm recording, at least. I hope this guy feels better. These Vera Vera Coons are a little different. Uh, you don't fight them, but they they target you, and then you can make them hit these signs. And then the gimmick of the room is you want them to hit this key, and then they'll all go away. I'm feeling a little more walk through than normal right now. You want to get as many of these as you can. We got all 70. If you get under 70, this chest won't spawn. 70 is all of them. Inside was Ragger 2. This is a weapon for Ralsei that makes his attacks deal more damage. We aren't attacking anything, so there's no real point. 
Hey, what the hell are these things? Hm. Looks like if we ride them, they might bring us over to the fountain. Really? Then let's get on! Enough, you foolish children! I have been merciful to you thus far, but now is your t but now is time for your unwillful imprisonment. Capture. Drop the capturing capsules. Uh, you missed. That was not a miss. It was a tactical calibration. So uh, are you gonna try it again? No, I only have like four cages. Okay, wait. I have a small plot twist for you. Come forward, my peon. Uh, um, sorry, I just couldn't say no. Noelle! Hi, Susie. Um, how are you? Um, okay, I guess. Your, um, roller coasters, um, I like it. Uh, yours too? Thanks! Okay, this isn't working. Bring in the next guy. Uh. Fear not, my beloved Noel. This valiant warrior of brave intelligence will be your knight and glow in the dark armor. Birdly? You asked Birdly to be on your team? I did not ask him. I did not ask him. I did not ask him. Uh. That's Lord Birdly to you, simpletons. And soon, Super Lord Birdly. <laughs> the hell does that mean? I have no damn clue, just go with it. You see, thanks to our wondrous queen, we will soon rule the world! And turn this land of fools into a smart-topia. A true scientocracy where the geniuses of the world can bathe freely in pools of fresh fruit and ambrosia. No longer held back by protozoans like you. And the key to that is us, Noel and I. Our power. The Light Nerd's power. You mean Lightners? Um, no. Queen said Light Nerds. I actually did. Birdly, Queen's just manipulating you. <laughs> That's what she said you'd say to me. I actually did. Now, Chris, I must admit I feel pity for you. Unlike Susie, I always saw some potential in you. Join our side, and I might let you scrub our royal toilet! Ugh, that is a tough decision, Birdly. But you know, I think I've gotta say no. Ah, Chris. I suppose I knew you would never amount to much. Well, if you're dead set on proving your inferiority... Allow me to assist you! Birdly rides in. Uh, basically, we just want to bump his roller coaster, but I want to check him because we don't really check very often. Birdly, go! Use your roller coaster cars to play Bump of Chicken. Chris, I get why you're getting in my way. You're jealous, aren't you? Totally. His attacks are actually pretty complicated. It can be hard to dodge these on the first playthrough. Although, honestly, I think the Werewire attacks are harder. Whole gang will attempt to bump into Birdly's car. Chris, you're tired of being the class number three, gazing distantly at Noel and I's fruited figures. He's right. I gotta admit it, he is correct. I am tired of seeing him. 18% every time we do Bump X. So rather than ever studying, you'd enlist Susie to take us down. So these spawn little thorns after the main part of the attack, which are the harder part. We're at 69% tension, nice. Birdly calls Queen for help, but Queen is pretending to be on the phone. Chris, you are truly depraved, playing in the mud with the class Hellion. Right. I, everything he's saying is true. But Chris, I am a kind and brave hero. If you come to our side, you may be a slightly less distant number three. 
Just slightly. He's attacking us with A-plus papers. What? My car is breaking? Fools! This is smart smoke! It means my car is getting stronger! Ha! Go ahead! Bump me, you bump barians! I'll show you bumper cars as a game of intellect, not skill! It does give you more time to react to the thorns than I remember with these attacks, honestly. Alright, let's bump into his car one more time. 108%. What? My coaster, it's... What? That's not fair! My queen, save me! In a minute, dear. Hello, everyone. I have some news updates. You see, this roller coaster, it's not actually finished yet. What does that mean? Pain. Looks like this trash saved us. Come on. <laughs> Who's king of the trash pile now? Ow! Susie, are you alright? <laughs> it's nothing. I just... Ow. Sure you don't want me to look? Look at what? I'm fine. Whoa, hey, what the heck are you- Feel better? Feel better after you just came up and- Um, doesn't feel worse, I guess. How do you do that anyway? That healing thingy. Oh, healing magic? It's simple, Susie. Anyone can do it. I could even teach you if you're interested. <laughs> Ask me again when it's like blood explosion magic. But, um, if you wanted, I, I guess I could learn it. Then you wouldn't, you know, have to annoy me with it anymore. Sure, Susie. Next time we have a break. Let's just go already, Chris. Next time on Deltarune, we are going to begin traversing the trash zone. See you guys then.